Welcome to the Tags Japan channel, and this is the literature segment. Today, we are going to share with you a topic titled The Seven Works of Natsum Soseki that are most discussed in the English speaking world. Natsum Soseki is a remarkable Japanese author, and we can describe him with the following phrases Exploring the depths of the human psyche, bridging the Meiji era and modernity through literature. In the literary canvas of Japan, few names shine as brightly as Natsum Soseki, a master storyteller whose narratives encapsulate the very essence of a nation caught in the whirlwind of change, the Meiji period. Today, we embark on a journey through seven of Soseki's most discussed works in the English-speaking world, which continue to resonate profoundly in the corridors of global literature. 1. I am a cat. Dive into the world viewed through the eyes of a nameless, witty, and observational cat that critiques the obsession of the Meiji era with modernization and westernization. Widely appreciated for its insightful narrative style, rich characterization, and linguistic craftsmanship, this novel remains a timeless reflection on human nature. A must-read for those who enjoy satire and a keen observation of society. 2. Kokoro. A profound narrative that delves deep into the human psyche, revealing complexities of relationships amidst the rapid transformations of the Meiji period. Acknowledged globally for offering universal themes of loneliness and understanding amidst societal transitions. A piece that resonates with anyone experiencing the chasms of generational divides and the solitude it brings. 3. Bachin. This autobiographical narrative recounts a young man's journey from Tokyo to a rural setting, exploring themes of personal integrity and societal hypocrisy. Celebrated for its vivid character sketches and an honest representation of provincial life during the Meiji period. A quintessential coming-of-age tale that paints a realistic picture of society and personal growth. 4. Sanshiro. A raw portrayal of a young man experiencing the cultural shocks and realities of transitioning to a modern city during the Meiji period. Renowned for its exploration of personal and societal transitions, offering both a historical and universal perspective on personal growth. A relatable story for anyone who has experienced the challenges of adapting to a new environment. 5. The Gate a deep dive into the life and marriage of a middle-aged couple, exploring the nuances of love, guilt, and redemption in the backdrop of Meiji-era Japan. Praised globally for its subtle and profound narrative, offering a meditative outlook on the complexities of human relationships. A heart-wrenching narrative that will resonate with readers seeking depth and emotional resonance. 6. Grass on the Wayside Soseki's most autobiographical work that presents a melancholy insight into the human condition amidst rapid societal transformations. Appreciated globally for its raw depiction of personal challenges and societal indifference. A piece that offers a deeply personal perspective on struggle and disillusionment. 7. The Three-Cornered World An artistic and philosophical exploration of art, beauty, and humanity through the eyes of an artist wandering in a remote area. Lauded for its lyrical prose and philosophical depth, offering a beautiful connection between art and nature. A delightful read for those seeking solace in the artistic depiction of nature and philosophical musings. Natsum Soseki's works serve as a rich tapestry that eloquently paints the socio-cultural shifts of the Meiji era, offering not just a glimpse into the bygone era but also a reflection on universal themes that are relevant even today. Whether you are embarking on a literary journey or seeking to explore the depths of human relationships and societal narratives, these works of Natsum Soseki stand as monumental pillars in the world of literature, inviting readers to ponder, reflect, and immerse themselves in the beauty of eloquent storytelling. 
We hope that this introduction has piqued your interest and that you find as much depth and enjoyment in reading these works as countless others have over the years. Thanks for subscribing. Thank you for joining us in this literary journey. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insightful content. Until next time, happy reading.